Hey everyone, welcome back to another counter side video. Today we're going to talk about Shadow Palace 1, rooms 1 to 5, a guide on how to clear it, and more or less you can you know mix and match the units that you're going to take in Shadow Palace 1. For that, if you want an updated counter side videos, please hit the subscribe button down below. Okay, guys, so we have here Shadow Palace 1. So we have five rooms for this one, and um, I'm going to take you through the battle preparations for room one. Okay, guys, so things to know for room one. Um, strikers will be banned for this one. And the key to winning this stage is going to be um, Jushiyun. Because you need to counter his darker self in this stage. And for your defender, I'm bringing um, Admin Shield Man. But you have the option of bringing Irie Alford or Stronghold. For Rangers, I'm going to bring Kyle and Jushion here and Admin Rifleman. Um, one of the um, alternatives that you can bring here is also Shinja. And um, oh, sorry, I forgot. I also have a paratrooper here. So the alternate would be Shinja. Um, as for your support, you have here um, Evelyn. Um, the, your other option will be Claudia. Uh, snipers, you have here Edel and Lyudmila. Of course, you can actually bring Sweeper as a sniper if you don't have them. Also, you can bring Shaolin. So, and also, if you do have Awakened units, um, they're, you know, they're the best to bring. I'm just bringing this because these are for those who don't have Awakened units yet. And let's um, more or less this team is built to auto this stage. So every time I do showcase a team, they can actually auto and clear it. And uh, I put in here Sigma. It doesn't have to be Sigma. And I put in here for the ship it's going to be Enterprise. So let's see this team clear this one. So again, guys, there are a lot of um, you know alternates for each of the you know the units that you bring. Um, aside from the units that I've mentioned, you can also you, you can also actually introduce some of the units do you, that you think you can bring in. You can actually try other units. These are so far the units that I've tried in clearing this stage. As for the gears, um, the most important gears here would be I think. Um, with Edel because of cooldown because she needs to you know put up some defenses like those minions that she has so as again um cleared for room one okay so let's proceed to room two okay guys so we are here at room two's lineup so we have Lin Shin, Alex and Cindy Looper at the um striker position then you have here Kyle Wong, Ju Shi Yun. Um, other, you know, other alternates would be Paratrooper Kim So Bin. And for your support, you have here Regina. Um, other, you know, other alternates would be Claudia as well. Then as your snipers, you have here Edel. You have here Lyudmila. Alternates will be Shaolin. She could be the main team, but I choose not to use her. And um, if you have awakened units as well, they're actually welcome to be used here. So let's take a look at this. This is also um, good for auto. Okay, so um, for this team, I think for the important gears that you have here would be um, Lin Shin, uh, CDR, Edel as well. You have to have good speed here in terms of deployment. Because you need to make sure that you can, you have to, you know, push back the enemies here. Especially Lumi. Lumi is actually pesky because of her ultimate, the truck that she has. So you have to push back from the initial attack that they have. So as you can see here, I've been pushing back for the enemies for a while. Then once I have the momentum, then I can push forward. So this team is actually built on a second wind um, that you have you just have to make sure that you have good defense and be able to mass your own units at the same time so again um hopefully i could clear this in one minute 30 and i think we're good here 
So basically that's it. So Lin Shin is actually your engine here, as well as Edel, as well as Regina. Okay, so we are here now at room three. Okay, guys, so here is my lineup for room three. So the theme for room three is actually just to overwhelm your, you know, your, your enemies. It's not really a challenging stage to have. So rangers here will be banned. To start off with, for the strikers, we have here Lin Xian, we have Alex again, and we have Cindy Looper. Um, they are actually good as your strikers. Um, I think you could also, you know, put in other strikers like um, uh, Einstein's Way if you have them. And also for the defenders, I have here Shieldman. Only Shieldman because I was supposed to bring in Irie Alford, but I opted for Cindy Looper. So that is it. Uh, I have for my snipers would be Lyudmila, Edel, and your alternate here will be um, Shaolin as well. Then for the supports, you have here Regina, you have Evelyn, and also your alternate here would be Claudia. So let's take a look at this on auto. So again, this stage is just mainly to overwhelm your opponents um nothing too special with the stage just have to um again uh, build up a lot of uh, what they call this defense at first then probably build up your reinforcements at the back as you know as you can see here um alex is doing the work up front together with admin shieldman then you have regina to bolster up the front line then you are actually inching your way towards the ship so this one is just really to overwhelm. Then you have there, who is that? That is Cindy going going towards the ship. So I think I can clear this in 1 minute 30. So then you have Lin Shin. Again, the engines are still the same. Lin Shin, CDR, Edel with the CDR um, sets as well. Then here there goes your um, room 3. Finish or win. Okay, so let's proceed, guys, to room four. Okay, guys, so we're going back to our old reliable. So you have so for this stage, we're going to have a max deployment of 25. So now I have 25 exactly. So um, for this one, you're going to be using for your strikers, Lin Shin, of course. You have Alex there. You can actually put in Cindy if you want. For your snipers, again, it's going to be Lyudmila and Edel. Again, you have the option to swap in um either shaolin or i think sylvia is is good for this one for your uh, for your rangers you have kyle wong you have admin rifleman you can actually swap in as well shinja or pirate trooper if you have and for the supports you have here regina regina um, support i think for this one um claudia is also feasible but i'm going with regina so let's take a look at this for room four and on auto. Okay, so again for this room, maximum deployment. The the one thing that you should, you should consider here is going to be Lumi. Again, Lumi is going to be your nemesis here. So you have to take control of her. Oh no, it's not Lumi. But anyway, um, this room, um, again, you, you also have to make sure that you put up well your defenses. This team is actually the, the, the lineup that I have here is similar to my room three team. Um, basically, I just used the bare minimum for this one in terms of deployment cost. That is why they were able to fit this stage. Okay, so here we are. Um, Nice, clear win for room four. Okay, so we have the last room here in Shadow Palace 1. So this is going to be a big warning for you guys. So here are the rewards. So let's prepare for this one. 
Okay, here we are at the, the boss room. So this is actually room number five. So mechs and uh, mechs are actually banned here and uh, deployment uh, cost is actually max at 25. So you'll be encountering three bosses here. So as you can see, I have uh, only one striker here. Striker, again, Lin Shin is preferably um, what you want to carry. Uh, alternatives would be Ingrid and Cindy. For your defender, you have Administration, Shieldman, and you have Ari Alford. You can actually put in Stronghold if you want. Um, Kyle Wong and Jushi on here. So again, Shinja and Paratrooper can be your you know, swap swap ends if you don't have them. Then for support, you have Evelyn Keller. Of course, Claudia is actually a good sub. And for, again, as your snipers, you have Edel and Yudmila. Um, swap ends could be Sylvia or Shaolin. So let's take a look at this uh, on auto. Okay, so we have here boss number one. This is, I think, Ogami. Um, again, the theme is to build up defense for this boss um, to be able to overwhelm. I'm not sure if I'm going to clear this in record time, but again, a clear is a clear so that you get the, you know, the goodies for this stage. So he's about to be done for Edel. And there you go. So basically, it was just Ogami that came out for this one. So hopefully, uh, yeah, um, there it is. Jushiun is here. Jushiun is out. And then the other one. Who's the other boss? Who's the other boss? Forgot to see the other boss. There were actually three bosses for this one. So that is why this will, you know, take you much time to conquer. Um, but I got it in one minute and 30. So that is a win for room number five for Shadow Palace 1. Okay, guys, so that is it for Shadow Palace 1. Um, you have there your alternates if you don't have those heroes or those units in your team. So it's a new record for me, and that is it. Um, I'll see you next in my um, Shadow Palace guide for Palace number 2. So anyway, guys, if you, do, if you have, you know, if you have stayed this far in this video, uh, please do subscribe because this helps my channel a lot. Also, please do... Click that bell icon and put a like to this video. Thank you guys. Stay safe. Take care. This is the Warden and I'm out of here.